All right, come on in, hit the like button, and think about subscribing if you're ready. If you're new here, welcome to the channel, but most importantly, welcome to the Viking family. So this is going to be my personal opinion slash review for 2023 future thriller film called Slimulant. Here is the plot. A humanoid AI uh, android attempt at winning a grieving widow's heart puts it in the path of the government agents trying to stop the rise of the machines. Now here's the cast. So to set up some more to the story without also not giving things away, um, so you understand more of it. So it's in the future, obviously, and everyone has these human-like uh, different models, I think all the way to F11, uh, AI-driven um, androids, either working as servants or the newer models as their dead loved ones replacements. There are program safety laws in place for protection. Just like the um, film iRobot. Now there are investigation officers, aka agents, that go after any that are unregistered, including human masters, are involved. Any of the crimes, obviously. Um, the older models are super creepy, but not as creepy as how realistic the newest models are. The CGI for every advanced tech in here, including the holograms, was such top-notch for a film like this. All the androids were all humans. Um, the old ones, the new ones, none of it was CGI. Maybe the eyeballs, but that could just easily be uh, Hollywood um, grade uh, lenses. Uh, but they all, the older ones have obviously prosthetics on them. Uh, there was a little bit of CGI on the chest part for the newer models when they open, but other than that, I think that's really about it with the, when it comes to those specific spots. Uh, but no complaint about the acting at all, any of them, but would say it could have gone a better way with three character story arcs. I personally didn't feel like how it ended fit the husband's type of character. Felt out of place in my opinion. Now here is my right now come back to my final thoughts. This story to me so much uh, reminds me of so much of season one at Westworld while also having some theme from the video game Detroit Become Human. Again, wasn't happy at all of how things ended, but everything else I really liked. But what did you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, keep, I'll keep you posted of my schedule for this week. It's gonna be a bit pretty complicated, uh, but I'll keep you a look in the community section on uh, my channel. Um, but in the meantime, remember, I love you all. Please stay safe and school.